Hey guys, welcome to Dead Please Stream. Today we're going to do something a little bit unconventional for this channel. Uh, this is going to be a how-to video. Because there is a whew, stupid, stupid thing going on with Call of Duty Modern Warfare. It is cross-platform, which, yay, hurrah, woohoo, but, but, it does not have cross-chat set up correctly for PC players. So if you, that means if you're playing with PC players and you're on a PC, you're fine. But if you choose to play with console players, it screws up. So um, I've looked all over the place, couldn't find what I was looking for to fix this, tried all the different steps. Nobody had the right answer for me. Finally, I figured it out and I wanted to share it with you guys because I didn't find a how-to on YouTube for this specific uh, step, these steps, I should say to get this fixed. So I wanted to do that and bring that content to you guys. If you got this, if it resolved your problem, please hit that like button. Help it to get up to the top of that list so other players can find it. As far as console goes, if you're still having issues, I, this won't help you. This is PC only. Um, but if you're a PC player trying to connect with console players over game chat, this should solve your problem. So without that, uh, without, without that, no, that's not it. Uh, without further ado, there we go. Let's jump into this. All right, so not ending. So over here on the desktop, what you want to do is you want to come down here to your little file, your little folder. And hold on, for some reason my Spotify is showing. Let's close that. All right, here is the little folder. We're going to open that up. You're actually going to go to the documents. Let me blow this up for you. Boom. Big old, big old, big oldness. All right. Go over here to Documents. You're going to open that up. You're going to go in here and you're going to find your Call of Duty. Make this a little bigger for you. All right. You're going to come in here and you're going to find Call of Duty Modern Warfare. So you're going to come in here. You're going to find the Players tab. I'm not sure why Players 2 is in here. You're not going to worry about that. You're going to go into Players. You're going to actually delete everything but this advanced options. I've already done this step, so I'm not going to delete these. But you are going to delete these items here. This is basically your setting, settings for your profile. But you don't have to worry because your main data is stored in the cloud on the servers for Call of Duty. So you don't have to worry about this step. Um, I mean, as far as losing stuff. You still have to delete these folders. So make sure you do that. And after these are gone, you're just going to come in here. And you're going to open this advanced options now on mine it's set to zero already you're actually going to change this setting configure cloud storage enabled equals it's going to be on one you're going to change that to zero if you leave this on one and you start it up it's going to pull all the, your settings from the cloud and that's where you get the lack of connectivity with your chat between consoles because those settings are built in for some reason to the cloud but if you set this to zero and then you save it. So when you set it to zero, it's going to ask you to save. You're going to hit say yes. It may require you to um, like say yes as an administrator. You're not screwing up Call of Duty by doing this. So go ahead and do that. Click that. And all you're going to do is you're going to go out. And you're going to go through your main steps of opening up COD. So let me uh, quick jump over to that section and show you that my, uh, my setup is now working. Let's open up COD. All my other random games here. Random games, because I like games. Anyway, this is going to take a second to load. And hopefully there's not an update. If there's an update, that's going to screw things up for me. Because I have not been home yet today to know if there's an update. I haven't played since Friday. But I think updates usually come out on Tuesdays, so we should be okay. Either Tuesdays or Thursdays, I believe. All right, looks like we're good. So we're going to hit play. And again, a lot of other people had other steps. So maybe if mine doesn't solve uh, your issue, you just need to go and check out some of those other steps. But this is the only one I could find that solved my issue. So I wanted to get it out there for you guys. All right. Here we are on the intro screen, Infinity Ward. And the biggest problem most people saw is when their stuff wasn't working correctly, the little test section in the menu where you could test your mic, even that 
was not pinging like it was supposed to to show that uh, you're talking. So some people like using push to talk, some people don't. Um, that's going to be up to you. Uh, we're going to skip this. Oh, we got a problem. This does this. If I press the wrong button, I don't know why it does it. It does it. It won't let me skip the stupid video. It's a, I think it's a glitch for everyone, not just me. Alright, so I'll just uh, come back right after I get this set up correctly here. That's going to take a second to close. But it does. I try to skip that scene sometimes, and it glitches just like that. So we're just going to wait. We're going to give it a second here. It's going to load. Everything is going to be all right. Sorry about the uh, delay. And I don't know why it has to play that stupid intro video every time. Really annoying. But at any rate, um, let me go ahead and get this set up here. It's connecting, fetching online profile, blah, blah, blah. There we go. Press escape. It's better. All right, so we're going to come in here. We're going to go right down to options. We'll go up to audio. And um, right now it's set to open mic. This is the threshold it's set to. So this is what it has to reach before it kicks in. Now if I do a microphone test, you can see the bar is moving. And it's doing what it's supposed to, chat. It's actually working. So, and you'll be able to see that everything works in, when you've got somebody in the game. I've already tested this with friends on PlayStation, so I do know it works. Um, so, again, here's the proof of the pudding right here. This microphone test does not work. If you don't do this setting, so hit that. I'm gonna stop it. We're gonna back out, and as you can see, everything else is there. My my challenge progressions, my character, um, everything I have is is there. We didn't lose anything, and it automatically populates those other items back. So it, even though you're deleting them, as soon as you run the game, it's gonna put all those things back. It's just gonna put them back without that broken setting in it, so that you'll actually have chat. So. With that said, I do. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, I, again, consider subscribing. Consider coming to hang out with us on the stream. Definitely hit that like button if this solved your issue. Follow those steps and you shouldn't have any issues, though. All right, guys. I'll catch you up at the next one. And, uh, yeah, peace out.